everybody well oh, I just hit the tripod then <laughs> hey everybody welcome back to my channel today is I keep hitting the tripod sorry about that today's video is going to be a continuation of my makeup collection um I'm focusing on the color cosmetics first before I go into the face makeup so today is uh, a video on all my liquid lip products be it glosses tints liquid lipsticks I've got minis in there I've got Korean brands, I've got Sephora brands, I've got high-end brands, I've got some things that I may have to throw away after this video, but I wanted to go over all of them with you and kind of show you what I have. So without further ado, let's jump right into this. Okay, I'm gonna start right at the top here with some liquid lipsticks from Urban Decay. This one is in Back Talk. Again, um, just like my other lip swatch, my, lip, my lipstick collection video, I'm not gonna swatch this because there's far too many. So, I'm gonna start uh, just by showing you what I've got. So I've got this Vice Liquid Lipstick in the color Back Talk. It's a beautiful pink color, it's a pinky nude. I'm really, I haven't had a chance to use it yet because I am doing my lipstick monthly, but it'll definitely be in the coming months that I will use this. The next one I have here is also a Vice Liquid Lipstick. This one is in the shade Zayas. This is in the shade ZZ actually. <laughs> Ironically, it's in the shade ZZ and there goes my cat's eyes. Um, this is a really pretty kind of darker mauve pink. It's super nice. Uh, and another, oh, there goes Zayas again. <laughs> another Vice a liquid lipstick. This one is in the shade WSM, another pinky color. I love Vice liquid lipsticks. They're super smooth, super creamy, but I don't think Urban Decay makes them anymore. I don't think they were well received. And another one, and this one's in a little bit of a different color. This one is in a deep orangey red. It's not a true red, this is rock steady. I have this actually in a stick lipstick as well and I love the color. Uh, and another one, this one is in the color Brat, which is kind of a glitter, more of a shimmery pink color. Oh, no, I'll finish. I'll <laughs> and finishing off, I think, Hopefully finishing off the Vice Liquid Lipsticks is uh, this one in Fever, and this is a special effects. This one is actually a lip topper as well. Oh, I lied. This is, mm, nope, this one's not finishing it off. This is another one in Purgatory. This is a shimmery purple color. They're all so beautiful, and I bought all of these products on a really big sale. Okay, uh, moving in to a Korean brand. This is the Chica Ichiko Matte Fix Matte Lip Color in the color... Anna, 002 Anna. It's a beautiful hot pink. Again, I have so many. I haven't had a chance to wear this yet. It's actually still sealed. Um, but I love this color and I've heard very good things and I'm really excited to test it out. Uh, next up, I have this Tardis lip paint. This is the regular kind, not the quick drying in birthday suit. Um, I got birthday suit in a mini size for my birthday gift last year, I think it was. Please ignore my awful nails right now. <laughs> I need to remove my nail polish. Um, and I loved it so much. I actually bought the full size when it was on sale for like, I believe 10 or $11 at Sephora this past year. Oh, <clears throat> I was lying. Here's another Vice Liquid Lipstick from Urban Decay. This one is in Trivial. Again, it's kind of more of a shimmery, peachy, beigey pink. Moving into uh, my Bite Beauty Liquefied, Liquefied Lipsticks. This one is in Chicory. It is this beautiful like mauve pinky, beigey color. I have a mini lipstick here from Makeup Forever. This one is in the color 105. It's this just browny beige. I have this Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick in the color Stripped, which again is another like nudie brown. I have this Ciate London Glitter Flip. I got two of these a couple years ago and I love them so much. I purchased quite a few more when they were on sale. This one is in the color Whisper um, and it's this like brownie nudie color and I love these things where they go glittery on your lips they're one of my favorite formulas oh my gosh another Vice liquid lipstick this one is in the color Trist it's this like reddish pink it's absolutely beautiful and I'm really excited to try this out I have a Stila liquid lipstick I think this one came in a kit um, that give me some nude lip kit this is in Caramello it is a brown color I have the Ciate Liquid Velvet Liquid Lipstick in the color Bittersweet. Again, it's kind of a brown, a brownie nudie color. Um, I also got this and it gave me some bold lip, I think, or give me some nude lip lip kit. 
I have a sample size of the Huda, Huda Beauty Lip Strobe. This one also came in and gave me some lip kit. This is in Snobby. I have used this a couple times. I actually really like it on top of the lips, but you can see, like, I have used it. As you can see, it's already going down in there. I have another glitter flip here. This one is in Infamous. This is one of the first ones I bought. It is that nudie pinky color. I have another Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is their lip gloss in Vintage. It's this really pretty uh, pinky lip gloss and Anastasia lip glosses are like shiny liquid lipsticks. They're so pigmented and I love to wear them. I have this mini NARS, what is it? Power Matte Lip Pigment in American Woman. I haven't used this yet. This is one of my newest ones. It came in, uh, give me a lip kit. Give me lip kit. I have another, a bite liquefied lipstick in the color Whip. It's really pretty nude. I have this melted latex from Too Faced. Um, these are also on sale. I believe this one came in a package that was destroyed. I had some Cinema Secrets. Um, I don't know the name of this, um, but it came in a package that was kind of damaged. I had some Cinema Secrets breast cleanser leak and it kind of ate through the sticker with the color on the back. But it's this really pretty nude color. This formula is very similar to the Anastasia Beverly Hills lip gloss formula where it's like uber, uber pigmented and it like sits like a shiny liquid lipstick. I really enjoy wearing these. I have another one here. This one's in Peekaboo. I have a few of these uh, NYX uh, soft matte lip cream. Uh, this one is in Amsterdam. It's this reddish color. And another one, here's the second one I've got. And this one is in the color Toulouse. It's a brownie nude. And I've got another one here in the color Barcelona, super duper pretty red. Uh, and another one in the color San Paolo. I've worn this one a lot in the summertime. It's this really nice pink color. Uh, and I have this one in Antwerp, which is like a beigey, corally nude. Uh, this one I have never even opened. You can see the plastic is still on it. This is a lip gloss from Gosh. I got this years ago as a gift, I believe from my best friend, but I never used it. So I think actually what I'm gonna do with this one is because it's not opened, I may just pass it along if it's not gone bad. Um, I'm gonna just pass it along to a friend. I have another melted latex. This one is in Unicorn Tears. Yep, yeah, this is the Unicorn Tears one. This is the holographic one that sits as a topper on top of other lip lipsticks that uh, you can make your lips look holographic. <laughs> uh, moving into tints for now, this is the Peri Peras Peri's Ink Velvet in the color I have no clue. I believe it's 001. It's this red color, but it's super, super small. It came in a little gift set that came in like a little fridge <laughs> with a bunch of other products from them. And I really like the Ink Velvet. It sits like a, a moussey liquid lipstick, which I really, 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 really like. I have some Etude House Twin Shot Lips X Tint. Um, as you can see, this one's kind of separated a little bit, <laughs> but you can mix it together. It's like a, a tint on one side and a gloss on the other. Oh, and here's the kitten. Anyway, Solomon, what are you doing? What are you doing? Let us, let us just shuffle. Good boy. <laughs> uh, this one is in the color uh, Inner and Pea Shot. So the blue is the tint. It's kind of a light pink and the pink is the gloss. Stop eating the box, you weirdo. Uh, I have another one. This one was one of the first tints I bought. This is from the Pink Skull Collection from Halloween, I believe two years ago in 2016. Um, and this one is in funky skull shot. So this reddish pinky shade is the tint and then the gloss is this black glitter. And this is the other uh, lip tint from that collection. This one is in pumpkin, pink pumpkin shot. So it's the pink is the tint and then the pumpkin is this orange glittery lip gloss. I have this 16 brand finger pen. Um, this one's applicator is like a sponge. So you click it up to get product. It's this hot pink color, which is nuts, but uh, you click it up to get the product up and then you just apply on your lips that way. Um, it's not my favorite application method, but the color is really cute. I have another Etude House tint. This is the colorful drawing Dear Darling tint. This is a gel tint. I gotta shake it again. Um, it's been sitting upright for far too long. Um, this is a gel tint and it was actually in, I believe, Glow Recipes. 
Oh, there's Zaz again. Zaz's favorite. <laughs> I believe it was in uh, Glow Recipe's top 10 last year of uh, products they have. I don't know if it's Glow Recipe or Mimi Box. I think it's Glow Recipe that they had on their website for the uh, number one product of the year for 2017. It's a really, really good tint. I have this tint. This is the Holika Holika Pro Beauty Lip Attention. This is a deep, deep tint. I actually did a review on this versus uh, Western style tint as well. Um, this one is very, very dark and it's kind of patchy. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do an impromptu declutter here and, and pass this one along. Uh, I have this Tardist lip paint in the color Yas, I believe. Yas. <laughs> and it's this bright lavender purple. Um, it's not an everyday color, <laughs> but I've worn it a couple times when I'm filming or when I'm taking photos and it looks fairly nice on, but it's not my favorite formula. I have this Makeup Forever liquid, it's the Artist, or lip, block, lip Gloss. This is the Artist Plexigloss in color 209. It's this hot pink. I haven't had a chance to use this yet. This came in a lip kit as well. Uh, this one I'm thinking I'm going to declutter as well because I think it leaked because this label here is like peeling off. This is the Chanel lip gloss in the color 109. I actually got this on for half price, so I think I only paid like 13 bucks for it. Um, but it's kind of starting to smell funny, so I think I may actually just throw this away. I have another Huda Beauty lip strobe. This one is in the color Shameless. It's this like rainbow iridescent, but still like that bronzy style of lip gloss. Super pretty. I have this Lise Watier lip gloss, I believe. Natural Lumiere in the color Aurora. This is super duper old, as you can see. Um, I gotta smell this. Oh, still smells fine. Um, I like this. I like that it has a mirror on the one side, which is awesome. Uh, the color's really pretty and it's really sheer. I have a Buxom lip gloss. This one is in the color Berry Bramble. This came in a big set last year. I bought the set solely because mine and my best friend's names were part of the set. <laughs> um, so I actually gave her her name and I kept mine for myself, but they only come in the, in that, they only came in that set. So I had to buy the whole set. So this is part of that. Uh, this one was the same story. This is in the color Claire and it's a really pretty glittery lip gloss. I have some lip toppers here from Becca. This is the Liquid Crystal Topper Glow Gloss. I have the color Pearl X Gold. And I have the color, I believe this is Champagne something. Or sorry, Champagne Dream and Bellini. So it was Champagne something. <laughs> Uh, I have this lip gloss. This is the YSL lip gloss in the color. Oh, it's a tint. Sorry. It's the Volupte Tint in Oil lip gloss. It's a pink color. I don't have the color here at all. 62 and 900. Is that the color? I don't know, but it's this really pretty pink color. Uh, back into Korean brands, I have two of these mousse candy tints from the Sim. I have the color grapefruit, which is a really pretty, like, orangey color and I also have the color peanut which is a really nice deep like earthy ready orange. Another lip gloss from that same uh, gift set this is cherry flip. I have another Ciate glitter flip this one is in Hollywood. Um, I wore this to my Christmas party at work and it looked absolutely beautiful. I have another liquid velvet. This one is a mini size from Ciate, and this one is in the color Head Over Heels. It's this really cute hot pink. I have another NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the color Stockholm is this brown one. I believe London was the one I used as a the tint comparison with that Holika Holika lip tint, but this one is in Stockholm, which is a brownie nude. I have a couple of these mini melted lipsticks from Too Faced. Um, this one is in Chihuahua. Again, uh, came as a point perk or a bonus or something. I like the color. I have this one as well, which is Melted Berry, which is a really pretty deep red shade. I have another glitter flip from Ciante. This one is in Holographic. This one is in Crush. I've tried this on. Um, I'm not seeing very much of the holographic going on in it, um, but it wears the same as the rest of them and I really love them. I have another soft matte lip cream from NYX. This one is in the color Tokyo. It's this like crazy baby pink. Moving back into tints, uh, these two are from a toot house. These are discontinued. They don't make these anymore and they expire in, oh, one of them's expired. This one's expired. So that one's being decluttered for sure. <laughs> 
This is the color Lips Tint. Jeez, they may both have to be, they're separated completely and separated and they're completely, so that's going in the garbage. This one might be bound for the garbage as well. Nope, this one's still good. All right, this is the Color Lips Fit. This one is Silhouette PK002 Silhouette Fit Pink. This is bright pink colors, perfect for spring. I have another of the Dear Darling Gel Tints. This is the Soda Tint. This is from their um, summer collection, I believe last year or the year before. This is OR201, which is this orange color. It doesn't come off this orange on your lips because tints are kind of sheer. They're not like liquid lipsticks, but it looks really nice in the summer. I have a Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in the color Lume or Loom. It's this really pretty berry purpley color. I have another lip tint. This is from La Neige. This is an Urban Coral. Um, it's in a specialized packaging, but it's a beautiful tint. I have another Holka Holka Pro Beauty Enamel Volup Tint. This one I believe is more glossy. This is PK01 Muse Pink. Beautiful packaging. I have another mini Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in the color Bocce. Again, I think this came in a nude lip or a set. I have a Smashbox lip gloss, I think this is. There's no color name on it or anything, but it's a pretty color. <laughs> I have a full-size melted uh, lipstick here from Too Faced. This is in Melted Candy. Um, I Nope. Nope, this one I just saw on the website it was on sale last summer, and it's a beautiful, beautiful pink color, exactly like what's on the packaging. I also have uh, this melted lipstick, which is Melted Melon. It's a beautiful coral color, perfect for the summer. And I also have Melted Metallic Tutu, which is, again, kind of a pinky coral color, but this one is metallic instead of just liquefied. I have another gloss topper, and this one is in the color topaz and gilt so it's got that like blue green tint to it um i also have another tart tartus lip paint this one came in a lip kit as well i think because i don't this is in crop top i don't think i would ever purchase this color um but it's like that 90s brown i have another stale day liquid lipstick from stila this is in patina i think this these three came in a Give me some nude lip, not nude lip, but like a nude set from Stila. This one is in caramel, so I got a mini of caramello as well. And I also have a mini of the Beso, which I think came in like a bright, a bright one. Um, I have another NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the color Morocco. It's this bright orange color. I love it. I have this Kat Von D liquid lipstick in Ludwig, which is again, like a little more of a lighter 90s brown, but still quite brown. Another of the Etude House uh, Twin Shot Lips Tint. This one is in Mug Chai Shot. This one is my favorite, I believe. The um, lipstick and gloss work really well together and the tint is a beautiful shade of like rosy pink. I have another lip tint here. This one is from the Berry Delicious Collection from a few years ago. Um, and this one is the purple one. Like it's in green packaging and it kind of comes off greeny and purple but it like transforms into just pink on your lips it's a really pretty color and i really like it packaging is awesome i also have another lips tint this one is in pure love shot again don't know how <laughs> shake this one up too i have two of these pop tastic um jelly tints from Holica from misha actually it's from their line friends collection and these ones are actually expired, so those ones have to be thrown out as well. They're not good anymore. Well, this is turning into a bit of an impromptu declutter. Uh, I have another Bite Beauty liquefied lipstick in the color Air Root. It's this beautiful, like, burnt sienna orange. I'm super excited to use it. It's one of my newest ones. I have this Kat Von D dark, pretty much like dark, deep, deep, deep brown one um, in the color Damned. Uh, I don't really like the name of it. Um, I haven't really worn this. So maybe what I'll do is I'll actually pass this one on to someone who will make better use out of it than I can. Another Vice special effects from Urban Decay. This one is in Reverb. It's this beautiful like purple iridescent glitter. Another of the buck. I have another of the buxom lip glosses. This one is in Peach Daiquiri. It's a beautiful peachy color, but super sheer, so it can go on other over other colors and look absolutely beautiful. I have a 3CE tint or gloss. This is the Three Concept Eyes Water Gloss in the color Encore. It's this pretty pink color that's on the lid.
too. So I have another of the Tint Fit, Tint Flip Tints, Color Lips Fit. It's expired as well, so that's gonna be thrown away. I have another of the Bite Beauty Liquify Lipstick. This one is in the color Braised. It's this beautiful like red, pinky red color. Super, super nice looking. I have a Peri Paris Vivid Tint Water. This came in the same like, I believe this came in the same fridge set as the three baby things. Came with two of these and then the three baby, little baby products. Um, this one is a pink one. And it's in number two. Uh, tint waters are not my favorite form of delivery, but they're most longest lasting tint you can buy. So this is a very much a pinky, hot pink color. I have the Smashbox Always On Metallic Matte. Um, this one's Exo Vlada. I haven't had a chance to wear this yet, but this is like metallic bronzy color, which is a really cool color. I have another Buxom lip gloss. This one is in Brook, again, pink. Uh, I have a full size of the Peri Peri Peri's Ink Velvet in the color eight, just eight. I think it's rose something. It doesn't say it on the bottom. It just says the number. Uh, this is a really nice tint. I really like it. It's moussey and it um, sinks in really nicely and it fades away really gracefully. I have the Tarte Energy Noir Lip Surgeons Lip Gloss. This is one of those color changing ones that, you know, reacts with the warmth of your body to tint your lips. I have another of the Smashbox and Vlada liquid always on petal metal liquid lipstick this is in desert rose it's a metallic as well it's very similar to the other one i have another liquid velvet from siate this one is in secrets again i think this came in a lip kit i'm pretty sure i have a mini of a smashbox Ooh. be legendary liquid oh be legendary lip gloss this is a lip gloss in disco rose it's this really pretty rosy color another buxom one i think this one is my name yeah that's kayla right there Good on you, Buxa. That's my name. <laughs> uh, this is the reason, this and my best friend's name is the reason I bought this whole set. I have a Trolls lip gloss from MAC in the color Saint Germain. This is lip glass from the Trolls collection. Another colorful drawing, Dear Darling tint. This is in the color OR206. It's a more of a darker, no natural orange. This one also came in a lip kit. This is the Huda Beauty Liquid Matte in the shade Trendsetter. It's a full size liquid lip. I have some of the old Urban Decay Revolution lip glosses. This one is in the color Vice. It's just this deep purple color. These are super pigmented as well. Um, and these, I've got three of them. I have two more here. Um, I have the color Apocalypse and I do not know. It's a red one. <laughs> it's missing the tag. But this red one, I don't know the name of, but this one's Apocalypse. These are super pigmented like the Anastasia ones. They're not quite as pigmented as them, but they sit the same way. I have two more of, uh, two of the full-size Anastasia liquid lipsticks in the color Sugar Plum and Dolce. Sugar Plum's on top and Dolce's on the bottom. They're these really beautiful, like, wintry, cool tone colors. I have this Etude House uh, fresh cherry tint that is expired, so that's going in the garbage as well. I have this mini Vice <laughs> lipstick, because apparently I don't have enough. Uh, this one's an amulet. Um, it's a mini. I really like this color. I just never had a chance to buy it. I have an Ulta super shiny lip gloss my, uh, in Mischief. Uh, this my best friend got me as a gift, I believe last year or the year before. It's a really nice neutral color. I have another Anastasia liquid lip. This is the soft lilac color. It's this really nice purple, cool purple. I have a Sephora Ultra Shine Lip Gel in the color Perfect Nude. I haven't used this yet, uh, so I'm excited to try it out. And I have another super, si super shiny lip gloss in the color Flirtini from Ulta. I have a Marc Jacobs lip gloss in the color sugar sugar which is like cult favorite color i haven't had a chance to use it yet but i'm really excited to another buxom lip gloss this is in stacy it's a purple i have another anastasia lip gloss this is in the color butterscotch which is this really really nude light nude color i have a peri paris sugar glow gloss um in the color five it's in the color five it's a really 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 shiny pinky color I have one NYX liquid suede, and this is in the color LSCL or 16. 
No, it's not. It's Little Denim Dress. Sorry. Uh, it's in Little Denim Dress. I bought this for my Maya cosplay from Borderlands because I needed a turquoise lipstick and I did not have one. So I picked this up on sale. I believe I got it for like four or five dollars. Um, it sits really like the liquid suede formula is a really nice formula. And I would definitely when I get through some of these after my Nova here, I uh, pick up some more of these. Another buxom lip gloss. This is in Sangria. Again, it's like a red. I have another Trolls a lip gloss from MAC. This one is in the color Turquoise. It's a horrible name, but uh, it's pretty packaging and the color is really nice too because it comes off really neutral on the lips. I have a Buxom lip gloss, again, in the color Mudslide. This is one of my favorite colors for Buxom lip glosses. It's a really pretty pinky color. I have a Rimmel. No, this is Revlon. Revlon. Nope, it's Rimmel. Okay. I have a Rimmel Stay Satin Liquid Lip Color in the color Yuppie. This is the Rosetto Liquido, it says. Um, I picked this up when we went to the event at, we went to an event at Shoppers Drug Mart here in town um, with a bunch of other uh, YouTubers in town. And I found this and it was on sale for like $6. I think it was like $5.99. And it's a really pretty color and I like a satin formula. All right, the last one is from Kat Von D, and this is a liquid lipstick in the color Noble. I believe this also came in a giving a lip kit because I don't think I would purchase this like concealer lippy color on my own, but it's got that little bit of a tinge of like brown to it, which makes it less concealer lip on me. Um, and I really like it. All right, so uh, that was everything for my liquid lipstick or liquid lip product collection that I have. I'm getting rid of nine products, either giving them away or throwing them away because they're expired and separated and not good anymore. Um, but so that is everything in there. Uh, what if if any of these are your favorites? Uh, let us know in the comment section down below. And if you like this video or want to follow along with me on my no buy year journey, uh, hit the little red subscribe button down below. And if you want to be notified when I post new content, don't forget to hit the little bell next to it. All right, we'll see you next time. Bye.